Hey, I hope you're doing good. It's Chris here from Six Room Finger Picking, and in this lesson, we're learning how to play everybody's favourite Renaissance song, Green Sleeves. Okay, so let's get into it. So this is a really fun, nice and easy song to play. So it's perfect if you're just getting into finger picking. So first off, what you want to do is hold down an A minor chord and then play the third string. Okay, and then you're going to play the second and the fifth string together. So you get like that. And then it goes to a G slash B chord. And what I do is uh, with my little finger, I'll play the third fret on the second string. And then my second finger, I'll play the second fret on the fifth string. Play those two together. So you've got, and then that goes to a C chord. So hold down a C chord and play the first and the fifth string. Put that all together. Okay, good. And then what you want to do, pull off two to open on the first string. Okay, and I use my middle finger for that. So, and then to a G chord, and you want to play the third fret on the second string and the third fret on the sixth string together. And then open second string, and then it goes to an E minor chord, and all you have to do is play the third string and the sixth string together open. Okay, so, so, so far. Sorry. And then. All right, and then second fret on the third string and then open second string. And that goes back to an A minor, so. Like that. See, even on that A on that E minor chord, we're only playing the third and the sixth string, but I still hold down an E minor chord like like that. And then I'll use my little finger on that second fret on the third string. Okay, and then of course the open second. And as I said, that goes to the A minor chord. Hold that down and play the second and the fifth string. Then the third string. And then the third string again, but with the fifth string in the bass. So and then we go first fret, second fret on the third string. So, and that goes to an E chord. So I'll hold down an E chord and play the second and the fifth string, then the third, and then the fourth and the sixth together. So the E is. Okay, so from that A minor. Okay, now right the way back to the beginning. G, E minor, A minor. Back to E. Okay, great. Then you play the second fret on the third string, and then it goes back to the beginning basically, and you repeat that. So it goes back to the A minor, to the G slash B, to the C, pull off, G, E minor, A minor, and that's where it changes there. So on the A minor, you play the second and the fifth string, then the third string, and then it changes to E. So we hold down the E and play the third and the sixth, sixth string together. Okay, and then we play the fourth fret, go stretch up, fourth fret on the fourth string, and then to the third string, which will be the first fret. Okay, so the E. So that's where, that's the only part that is different. So on the A minor, to E. And then we go back to A minor. And on the A minor, what you can do is play the third and fifth string together twice. So that is like, But 
that's the only difference okay so remember you go all the way back to the beginning it repeats but it's slightly different uh, at the end so the first time we had This is where it changes. So that was the first part of the song. The second part goes like this. other section of the song so this starts on a C chord so you want to hold down a C chord but also add your little finger to the third fret of the high E string okay and then with those fingers held down like that play the first and the fifth string twice okay and then we're going to pull off second fret to open on the first string so so we go to this G chord like this, so remember sec second string, third fret, play that with the bass note, open second string, and then to E minor, and you can just, just like before, play the third and the sixth string together, and then that's the second fret on the third string, open second, and to A minor, so, so far. Okay, and then back to A minor, play strings two and five, then three, and then three and five, and then first fret, second fret on the on the third string, so and then to an E chord. So we hold down our E chord and we play strings two and six, then three, and then four and six. Okay, so. Like that. Then it goes back to the C and it's very similar to before. So this is the same. To the G, E minor, and then on this A minor is where it changes. So it starts the same. So we hold down the A minor, play strings two and five then strings the third string and then we go to our E and on the E chord we'll play strings three and six but then just like in the first part of the song we want to stretch up to the fourth fret of the fourth string play that and then the first fret of the third string so and that takes us back to our A minor and just like before on the A minor chord play the third and the fifth string together twice okay so second half and let's do the first half of this section once more so And that's it. So that's both the parts of the of green sleeves. Practice them individually, put them together, and you've got the whole song down. Okay, so that's it for this lesson. I really hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you again really soon for another great fingerstyle guitar lesson.